right, guys. Miss Regina here from the library, Art Castle Library. Um, just wanted to hop on here and do a story time for y'all. Today we're going to be reading a Little Tree. It's by Lauren Long. It's called Little Tree. I figured since we were getting towards fall and the leaves were starting to turn, be a good book for us. Once there was a little tree filled with little leaves who was surrounded by other little trees who had their own leaves. Look at the little trees there. In the heat of long summer days, little tree's leaves kept him cool. The squirrels would climb up on his branches to play. The morning dove landed in him and sang her flutey song. The little tree was sure to grow up big and strong. Autumn arrived and cool winds filled the air. The wind tickled the little tree as it passed through his branches and ruffled his leaves. The air grew cold and the leaves on all the trees changed colors, becoming yellow, red, and orange. All pretty colors. Then one by one, the trees began to drop their leaves. But not little tree. He hugged his leaves tight. Hello, little tree, said a squirrel. You're supposed to drop your leaves now. But Little Tree was unsure. What would he do without his leaves? He's still holding on to them. Winter came. What are you doing with leaves still on you? Asked the doe. Little Tree just hugged his leaves tight. Springtime arrived and the little forest burst into life again. The other trees grew bright new leaves. The squirrels played in their branches. Little Tree could hear the morning dove singing her flutey song. Her little tree. Still hasn't let go of those leaves. The seasons continue to come and go. Little tree quacked a duckling. Your leaves are brown. Are you feeling sick? A fox said, little tree, it's autumn. It's time for you to drop your leaves. You can do it. Ready? One, two. But little tree just hugged his leaves tight. All around the forest grew and grew. Oh, there's little tree. One summer, little tree could no longer feel the sunlight. The squirrels played high above on the broad, tall trees, and the morning dove sang so far away that he could only hear her flutey song. There he is down there, and all the other trees that grew up. Autumn came again. Leaves began to blanket the ground. Little tree looked up at the other trees, at their branches reaching high into the sky. He remembered when the trees had all been his size. And then he let go. All the leaves are falling. As his last leaf floated to the ground for the first time, Little Tree felt the harsh cold of winter. But in time, he grew and grew. Something happened. Once there was a little tree. But he grew. And he got tall, and you can see he's standing with all the other trees. He just had to let go of those leaves, didn't he? I hope you guys enjoyed uh, Little Tree, and we'll try to come to you again for another story time soon. Um, just a reminder, the library, the Rockcastle Public Library, we are still doing to-go craft kits for the kiddos. You can request those once per week. Um, stop by and pick those up um, for the kids. And um, we'll, you can also follow and like our library Facebook page, Rockcastle County Public Library. Find us on Facebook. And you can get updates about us there. Um, we try to keep everything posted there. We hope you guys are doing good. Everybody take care and see you next time.